Hello, all you wonderful people! My name is Barry Falls and welcome to a new GTA 5 100% walkthrough episode. Today we have a mission called Predator and it involves every single one of my protagonists. That's awesome, I can control every single person in this mission. In order to start it, you can just switch to Franklin after the mission Polito Score setup and it will automatically start or you can go to the T on the map with Trevor or Michael it will play a huge cutscene and then it's gonna start. So choose what you want and of course we have 100% gold requirements and they are complete the mission within 9 minutes. Finish with an accuracy of 70% or more. Kill 3 enemies with a headshot. And don't kill any animals. If you wanna get the time requirement, I suggest just switching to Franklin, not listen to any dialogue any cutscenes and also show you a very cool shortcut you can take. So in the first attempt I'll just do it the traditional way, just show you a bunch of stuff, extra dialogue and whatnot. In my second attempt I'll go for gold, show some shortcuts and some cool things. Ok guys, are you prepared? This is Trevor's trailer, we can start it. If we enter it, it will play a cutscene and advance the time. Hey Jimmy, it's your dad. Listen, if you get this, can you give me a ring? Tell your mom too, will ya? And Tracy, please, son. Your daddy's been a bad boy. Uh, please, son. <laughs> you want to sniff? The fuck is wrong with you? Oh, weirdo. <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. So I'm just trying to prove my patriotic duty by, you know, doing this stuff. Oh, man. It's cheap, but it's good. Gasolina? No. No. <laughs> wow. Sorry, Mrs. M. Jesus. Mikey, you want a beer? Oh, shit, I'm sorry I don't have any low car. Oh, fuck oh. you. So where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. You kind of do. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah, you know, there's more to this gig than just going crazy all the time. Killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what? Deep down, I know you believe the bullshit. The picket fences, the fucking happy endings. And your street philosopher bullshit. That's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah. You've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> You've gone. Man, ten years in the sun, your brain has melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? Did I fucking kill only on the weekends? So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Sounds well, great, actually. To you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. sane, 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 oh, okay. sane. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking mental health clinic. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, fuck, now you're gonna stop being an asshole? I don't know, but I'll try. That's impossible for well, Michael. That, I like your honesty. And for Trevor, too. You are both assholes. I uh, spoke to Franklin. Why? Unlike you, he hears that his homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low? Out here? By calling LS and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what, for a little visit? That He's right. is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. You instantly think about yourself. Trevor's also right. <laughs> You're right. I did do that. You were both right, dudes. Apologize. It's not good enough. Kiss my feet. I'm leaving. Huh? I might die. Hope you're happy. Right. Hey, I'm coming with you. No. Yes, I am. No. If nothing else than to get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boys. Oh, I'm going. Make sure you don't. Don't fuck stay it up. out too late. <laughs> I love this woman. <laughs> She's so cool. After Jeff a little bit, he's gonna switch to Franklin and continue the mission. It doesn't matter where you go. You can just go to the trailer if you want to. So what is Franklin doing for you anyway? He's tailing some guys, Mikey. Tailing. Mikey. Let's go, Mikey. It, it switched automatically, I did not switch it myself. If he's back in Sandy Shores, why didn't I hear about him? God damn it! Damn! These redneck fools know we own them now. What are you wearing, Franklin? I gave you a good outfit. Why do you constantly change? 
Oh, he's gonna have such a bad outfit now. It's the default right, outfit. We gonna fuck him up as soon as Trevor get here. God damn it, man. Oh, my hard work with picking outfits. Rrr. Hey, man, me and Chop on these punks. We're coming up to WH, north of Chumas. All right, all right, the O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo. When one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are gonna take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. Yeah. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. What's well, kind of stupid is sometimes Franklin says, oh, there's too many of them, I'm gonna wait for Trevor. He has Thank taken out know. just hordes shit, of enemies. Shit. He has had huge police battles. And he's worried about three people? What the hell, man? Kinda weird, but it happens. Get on me. He yours, chap. Let's do this shit. Uh, what are you wearing? <laughs> He's so bad. Uh, whatever. Oh, my frames are gone. No, my frames. Give them back. For 50 FPS. <laughs> Trevor, man, shit. You there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed. They dead? No, nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Close the doors, Franklin. He did not close the doors, bad boy. At least he tried. Don't worry. Incoming. Incoming to save you. It also stops for some reason there. I did not stop myself. Incoming? Man, you're all business. Always. Yeah, well, this is kind of important. These men don't like me, and they know we're back in the sandy shore, so... Here she is, the Biz Alley. Remember, she ain't mine, she's the company's. Good to know. It says, fuck, what, fuck? Fuck the cops. Fuck, <laughs> fuck the feds, <laughs> okay. It also says, pants down, dick out. <laughs> pants out, dick out. It really is your chopper. <laughs> Too many hey, questions. Take my side for once. Hey, I'm coming along for the ride, ain't I? Yeah, but I sense your heart ain't in it. Yeah, I'm lucky my heart ain't in a pie on your kitchen table. Always with the quips. You're such a depressing cynic. You too. Oh, poor Trevor. I'm sorry I'm a human being with thoughts and feelings and emotions. <laughs> you? Wait a second. I remember this chopper. We used this to break into the IAA building. You stole it from the FIB? Not so. I took it in lieu of payment. There was a rifle on board too, so if your panties aren't all in a twist over stolen office supplies, can you please use it to scan the forest for the O'Neills? Oh, I'm your hitman now. I'm not gonna force you, Michael. You don't wanna help? You can get out right now. Yeah. We are gonna be over water, so get out. So he said office supplies. Dude, I have stolen pants from work. But this is a different thing. <laughs> this is a huge helicopter, not a, a pen or a stapler. Dude, <laughs> this is not office supplies. <laughs> okay, let's go here. He's gonna continue the mission. Hey, hey, we here on the ground. Them hick dudes in the woods. That model's fitted with a thermal scope. Look for their heat signatures. So I can switch to thermoscope, and you can see a bunch of stuff. Let's look at this. Do you know what this is? This is Bigfoot, guys. Check the river. They might be trying to float out of here. Yep, that here was Bigfoot. And you have to find basically the people. We have one person here. Uh, yeah, he looks like a human being. I got a guy taking a walk in the woods. You can activate his special ability for better headshot thing. Like this. And he did. Good. 
This is how you should do it for gold. You can also shoot animals, which is gonna prevent you from getting gold, but you get different dialogue. Oh, what? Okay, he's behind the rock, I guess. Did this thing... <laughs> what the hell? Any of them punks waiting around in the shallows? Hold her steady, T. I'm gonna bag me a prize buck. Here, yeah, prize buck. You know, Russian oligarchs pay millions to hunt game like this. If you shoot more, you get different dialogue. Jesus! I almost think you want this guy to escape so he can come back and kill me. Mm -hmm. Hanging out with hillbillies, I might as well act like one. Let's shoot here once. He's gonna say, oh, you suck at shooting or something, poor aiming. It's sad seeing you miss like this, Michael. There we go, he said it. Okay, let's go and kill this dude. And what are you doing out so late? Yeah, so late. Oh, there's a guy in the creek over here. Plop. I got him. Just one poor soul remaining. Moving target brought down. Higher ground, Mikey, you find them on the hill. Mike, they're... If you zoom in, this is gonna happen. To shoot at. He's behind a rock. It's on you, homie. So the shortcut is through alive. here. Just go through here and you're gonna go right at him. However, since this is the first attempt, I wanna show you the intended way. I'll just follow Chop. Back him down, Frank! We're about to get shot out of the sky here! And get some dialogue. Come on, choppy boy. If you swim Let's go and do it. I am too. Fuck. This water is cold as a motherfucker. Yep, and I have to jump. In the cold ass motherfucker water. Motherfucking water. Let's go, Chop. He's still shooting, by the way. He's not gonna hit him, don't worry, guys. No matter how long it takes, we have a few bucks. Let's switch to a weapon. And the person you saw him is right over here. And Chop is right there on him. Is. Get that motherfucker! I'm the last of my kind! Yes, I'm here to help! Last guy's done, homie! Alright! Stay there! We'll come down and pick you up! Alright! Woohoo! You can switch to Trevor if you don't. He's gonna... He's gonna switch automatically in a little bit. After a few minutes. So let's go down, pick him up and the mission is pretty much complete. Alright, now that the angry hillbillies with rockets are dead... Is there anyone else we should worry about trying to kill you? Oh, sure. Yeah, there's some bikers, the Chinese, Madrezo's people, but whatever. Don't act like you're so popular. All right, back to the airfield. Back to the airfield. And after we land, the mission is complete. Pretty easy stuff, but it's an interesting mission. I love it. Pretty creative. You know the airfield's mine, don't you? Oh, yeah. You can afford a runway, but you can't afford to move out of that corrugated metal desk shack. True, true, true. Oh, For show, sure, he is the wrong part. Yeah, right. Man, he kills people for fun. He should be dead right now, but he's not. Here we go, taking her down. There we go, taking her down. Blip. Don't it feel good, huh? Helping a friend in need. Come on, chop. Come on. Oh yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Castle Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Yep, here we go. The mission is complete. We helped Trevor. And we did not get gold, of course. 47%. Pretty bad. Not three headshots. And yeah, this is it, guys. 
It's as simple as that and this was not the 100% requirement attempt. I'll show you the next attempt in a little bit after we get a phone call from Lester which is gonna unlock the next heist. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. Which I'll do in the next episode. It will be so, so, so sweet. And this is it, guys, for the first attempt. Let me replay the mission and get gold. Damn, these redneck fools know we own them now. And welcome back once again. We're gonna get gold this time. I'll show you a few shortcuts and a few uh, things you can do to make your life better, a little bit better. So let's go. Of course, we have to follow them again. And maybe I could have done this the first attempt, but I don't think it's possible to listen to all the dialogue, watch all the cutscenes. I did do a few tests, but they were inconclusive. I could not figure out exactly if that's true, but you can see two different ways of passing it, so that's fine. That's cool. Let's go here again, and I suggest using Franklin's special ability when there's a huge bump or something, if there's a turn, a big turn, you can take, just use his special ability and he can turn much, much, much easier. Just like that. As you can see, I got here a little bit faster than last time. I'll skip this and also after you get out you can get back in and go to the car a little bit faster. Again, not much of a difference, but it saves a few seconds. So that's nice. You have to go, Trevor. As soon as it dials, you have to. You don't have to, but it's a good idea to hang up. Don't worry. Because to switch to these guys a lot faster, and as you saw, it also stops here. As you saw, I did not watch the cutscene, I just switched to Franklin immediately. And after I did, what the hell are you doing? Man, you're all busy. After I did, yeah, well, it uh, started the mission automatically man. and it saved Don't so much time. Because if you watch the cutscene, it's gonna uh, make them get out of the trailer. It's gonna take a few seconds to switch to Franklin. So yeah, much, much, much faster this way. Switch to Franklin to get gold. Alright, so let's continue. We have to fly all the way to the place, the woods. And they'll bicker a little bit between each other, like always. Which is a big problem I have with this game. A little bit of bickering, screaming, calling each other assholes is fine, but if I, but I think it's a little bit too much in this game. It happens way too often. So, let's go. Once again, like I said, I'll do three headshots and I'll use Michael's special ability. He has a very cool and appropriate special ability for this mission because it slows down gameplay and that's great. I won't look at Bigfoot, I won't shoot bucks because if you shoot bucks or is it called deer, bucks, elk, how do you call it even? I don't know, if you shoot these guys it's gonna not, you're not gonna get gold. So just shoot the people and get headshots. Cool. Skip this. Activate the heat seeking and headshot. Good, good, good. We have one more person right here. No, it was right here. Okay. Cool. Bam. Good. And we have one more person over here. Let's skip the cutscene. And don't follow Chop. Go right over here. Also, you can uh, switch to Chop if you want to. I forgot to say that, but you can switch to Chop if that's your forte. But you want to do this as fast as possible, so you're gonna go in this direction. Switch to appropriate, an appropriate weapon. And make sure not to uh, miss, because if you miss two times, you're gonna get 60% accuracy. You don't want 60%, you want 70%. So get close and then shoot. Plop. You saw Michael shoot, but he sucks. <laughs> that was an awful shot, Michael. Very bad attempt. For me, it's a good attempt. It's a perfect attempt. I think I got 100% even. 
on accuracy. Plip. Nice flashlight, bro. Well, let's go. Airfield. And as you can see, it's been like five minutes so far. So yeah, it's much, much, much faster if you skip our cutscenes, skip our dialogue, don't listen to anything, and shoot them as fast as possible. Don't bother with elk, with Bigfoot. That's a nice easter egg. I think the first uh, time I did this mission I saw that creature and I thought the game bugged out or something. Because it just disappeared, I saw a person, I thought it was a person, it disappeared, so I was like, hey, game is broken. But no, that's a easter egg, which is a nice easter egg. Kinda makes the game, the mission look broken for new people, but eh, it's a nice easter egg. I like it. We also see Bigfoot in other missions too, which show, show in different episodes, way later on in the game, so you're probably gonna forget until I reach it. So we have to land, and the mission is complete. Oh, beautiful landing. <laughs> Not. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, for show. Nice land. And the mission is complete! We're gonna skip the cutscene and we're gonna get, guess what? Goat 100% in 6 minutes! Wow! I saved 3 minutes in that! Beautiful! And with this, guys, the mission is completely done! Expect a heist in the next episode! Stick around, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode! Before I go, I wanna thank my lovely Patreon supporters! Vlodas, Austin Data, How's the Chowder, Alex Chavez, Max Robinson, and everyone else listed on the screen! Thank you so much for the support!